Hey, it's Indie Artist Manifest here with 468,000 monthly listeners on Spotify, and I'm going to show you how to submit your songs to the Spotify playlists and get added. But the first thing you need to do when you release a new song is you need to distribute it with like DistroKid, TuneCore, or CD Baby. I'll put links below here so you can distribute your music. And you need to schedule it ahead of time, okay? You need to schedule it weeks in advance. And I just distributed this on December 1st, but it's not coming out till December 21st. And so now if I go to my artist's profile, okay, I click on my artist profile here, artist.spotify.com. If you haven't created your login in your profile, you need to do that. And then if you click on upcoming, okay, because you got to wait for about 24 to 48 hours, you'll see your song in here. And so now I have the opportunity to pitch a song and get heard by their editors so that I can get added to a Spotify playlist. And remember, you got to always schedule a release weeks in advance, and I'll show you even why here. Let's click pitch pitch a song. And it says now, um, we'll add this song to release radar, which is so important. If we get your pitch at least one week before release. And so I like to do it at least two to three weeks so I get a better shot. Okay, so it's really important. So I'm going to click next. And Editors sometimes look for music made by people from specific parts of the world. And so they want to know, you know, what your hometown is. And so I'm going to put Toronto, Canada. Boom. Okay, so that's currently my hometown right now. And I'm going to click Next. And what is the genre, main genre of this? Well, for this one, this is a different one for me. So this one's actually spoken word. It's, and I'm pretty sure they have that. Yeah, audio books and spoken word. I've never done that before. Choose up to three subcategories. And so I'm going to say uh, nonfiction and I'm going to say spoken word. And now it's saying choose music cultures. Well, I'm going to use Christian. And the moods I'm going to say for this one is going to be energetic. And I'm going to say uh, probably fierce for this one. Okay. And then it's asking for the styles. And you don't have to choose any of these. Okay. I'm going to say none of these because it's not really like that. What instruments, um, you know, there's probably like music in here, but it's it's more of a spoken word piece. But then I'm gonna, I'll come back to that later. Is this a cover? No. Is this a remix? No. How is it recorded? It was recorded in the studio. Is this an instrumental? No. And then it wants me to say, are there lyrics? Uh, choose up to what, what, what language the lyrics are in. I'm gonna say English. And then I click Next. And then it says, tell us about the process of creating this song as well as any plans to promote it. It's really important to share something in here, okay, and, and connect something. And then you're going to click Next, and then you're going to click Finish. And then your song will be submitted to Spotify playlist to their editors to at least listen to it. Does it guarantee you'll get on a playlist? No, it doesn't, but it does increase your chances. And so definitely share some stuff here. Don't blab on. Say, yeah, please put my song on an editorial playlist. Like, say what you've got going on. you got a tour going on. You just got in a TV film placement. You just hit a certain amount of followers. A uh, uh, famous producer, producer. you got a big feature on there. Okay? Um, so try and put something in there. Don't just leave it blank. All right? But put something that's important. Don't just waste space either. Words matter not just in your lyrics but they matter when you're promoting a song so I do this for every single song I release and this is why you should not just whip it up there you need to have space in between your song releases hope this helps you out if you don't got a copy of my book Spotify profits or the video course showing you all kinds of strategies on how to get on more playlists indie playlists how to run ads and so much more and how I got almost over half a million monthly listeners you definitely want to read my book Spotify profits or get the video course showing a whole bunch of ninja strategies on how to schedule your music and how to get features on your on your on your songs and really just blow up your career without having to tour and without a record label